I don't see any reason to um, change the model charge. I think it's clear. You're telling the jury you can draw an inference. And then, Your Honor, uh, one area that I think you're going to agree needs to be addressed is the, the, the we need a better charge language on the preponderance standard. Because at your initial charge on the burden and standards of evidence, you talk about reasonable doubt, but there's an, a very important shift in the standard which the jury must use to assess the insanity defense. It's the much lower standard of preponderance. And that's why I took the language uh, mostly from the model jury charge, civil jury charge, um, charge number 1.12i, and I submitted a red line version so people could see the, the model language and the language that I proposed to put this into your charge on the insanity defense. Mr. Shellhorn, what's your position? Judge, the model charge was adopted, I think, in 1988, if I'm not inaccurate about that, about the insanity. I don't know why there would be a need to start modifying it with this case. There's nothing unique about this case that will call for that. I agree. The court's charge is directly from the model charge on insanity, model criminal charge. Well, as, just as, as this is a criminal case, not a civil case. And I, I don't think your proposed charge is particularly neutral. Whereas the model charge is meant to be just that, neutral, especially as it pertains to the defense of insanity. Your Honor, I think the fact that the charge hasn't been revised since 1988 is actually a fact to the detriment of its use as written, because what happens frequently with model charges is they don't keep pace with the developments in the law. So I again would advocate... What, what's, what's been the development in the law since the model charge was drafted as the preponderance of the evidence? I don't think that's changed since 1988, that the court has a new view of what preponderance of the evidence standard is. I agree it's with remained, you. It's remained the same, and the charges remain the same. I, I don't think that the actual uh, law on what constitutes the preponderance of the evidence has changed, but I do believe that the language that's written is inadequate to give... Uh, a, a non-biased charge on what evidentiary standard the uh, jury should use to decide the insanity defense. I don't think there's any need for an alteration in the model charge, counsel. Thank you. Thank you, Your Honor. All right, All right you ready for summations? Yes. Yes, Judge. At the end of the summations, I'm not sure how long they're going to go. Um, I'll decide whether or not I'll charge this morning or maybe break for an early lunch and then charge this afternoon. I'll make that decision after I hear summations. All right, let's bring the jury in.
I got one. We are hold up one second, please. Got copies of the charge, Council? Yes, Your Honor. Thank All right. you. All right, we'll bring a jury in now, Katie. Thank you. <laughs> jury entering. 